Hey guys, this is Chris Martin with the Real Albuquerque podcast, videocast. We have Jen Applegate Anaya. Uh huh. Okay, we got it there. Ja. Or, or Jennifer. Ja or Jennifer. Or Ja or Jennifer. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you prefer. Today, uh, in our burrito review, we have some unmarked bags, of course. Ooh, cool. Um, uh, that is a burrito from Crazy Lizard. You said you don't know who Crazy Lizard is. I have is. no idea who Crazy Lizard is. I didn't know is. who they were until we actually, uh, the guys from Stone Forge episode two and Kirk and all that kind of stuff. John and Kirk brought them to my attention. And we also have the Range Cafe, uh -huh. which is an epic place. They have Ooh. a pretty good setup. This is pretty good, right? Is it good? I want to see quite Yeah. <laughs> so per usual, I'm going to cut these bad boys in half. And uh, we'll get this thing going. You cut them in half? Yeah. <laughs> you know, just... You just manhandle them? Manhandle them. Ah. No, he asked me if I needed a fork, and I was like, for a burrito? <laughs> well, look at this, dude. This may, <gasps> this may... Well, I don't know. That's what we have napkins for. Yeah, we don't have a fork for this. <laughs> but... That is a... That's a big pretty... Big-ass knife. Well, well nice I mean, this, this is... Look at the burrito. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Steak. We got some green chili on the jeans. On the jeans, but that's okay. <laughs> right, that that's that happens. And we'll in like in the side break, we'll have to eat all these beans and stuff like this because this is good stuff too. Oh heck yeah. Okay, so let's start off. We have our napkins here. He doesn't really need that for sure, right? I know, and you took that burrito away from me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still focused on that burrito. <laughs> Chloe's over here eating uh, the frijoles, so she'll be okay. All right, so this is the Range Cafe Burrito. You said sausage green, right? Yeah, is what's sausage your favorite? green, sausage why is, green. Why is that your favorite? You don't like red or bacon? I thought I'd switch it up because I usually- Or did you say bacon green? I'm, I don't know actually. I can't remember, I'd have to look it up on the text. I don't, I don't remember, but I got sausage green for whatever reason. Yeah. Is that a problem? I like green, it's not a problem. Okay. Yeah, because it- Well, you had that little pig face, so I can't remember. Is that sausage or- Sausage is a pig, but bacon is also a pig too. So okay. It's, yeah. I don't remember. <laughs> Do you ever do that? Like you like read those messages and then you like you act at the moment exactly know what that message says and then twenty minutes later you like do something totally different because you think you read it something different. You know what I'm talking about? I I know. Oh okay. But I do know that there's times where I get those little emoticons and I'm like I have no idea what you're saying right now. Yeah. What does this flaming poop mean? <laughs> Is that a good thing? He's Do you smiling. you know that I'm saying that this is a heart bomb? Like, or when I put a peach, it's to be a butt. Oh. Like a, a peach, like a little peach emoticon looks right. like a, a butt. So I'm like, butt, 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 butt. Poop, 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 poop. People are like, are we going to the, the grower's market, the farmer's market? What's happening here? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. So, well, it's green, but I do like, I just like green. I prefer green. I like Christmas tree, but I like it all on the side. Oh yeah, then you. So I can like dip to my liking and control the flavor. Right. <laughs> really, it's. Well, sometimes you get those burritos and it's just massive amounts of sauce on the inside, mm -hmm. which I'm not. I'm not saying is a bad thing, but I know what you're talking about. I yeah. like to dip too. Yeah, I like dipping. I like so this dip. is pre-dipped. Pre-dipped. <laughs> it's already pre-dipped with sausage. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Dang, that's pretty good. Mm-hmm. I like their sausage. No, yeah. I bit the sausage part too, and it's all over my face. <laughs> mm -hmm. This is a smothered burrito that we're eating with our hands. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so, so if I look silly or if we look silly, I don't know. I'm like, and um, because mm. <laughs> I've never done this before. People look at the store like, you know, we have knives and forks, right? But it's Jen, and she yeah. has to eat with her hands. <laughs> it's delicious. It's I'm just so hungry yeah. this morning. Me too. Um, we had a really good cuddle session with like myself and my husband and Mason, my son, and the dog. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and that was pretty fun. And that took a lot of energy. Cuddling is intense. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and you're like, I don't want to wake up this morning? Or? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. More of like, just, I don't want to get out of bed. It's so warm <laughs> and cozy. Then we started dancing, and that's all fun. <laughs> <laughs> it's fun in our house. Yeah, it sounds like it. Um, mm. We're going to go more into your funness in the second mm. part of the show. Now, this is... I'm already past... Um, I'm already to the bottom of my section here. That's like the best part. I know, right? I'm actually going to start at the end <laughs> on this one. You know, that's funny you mentioned that. One it of the burrito reviews like... with one of our friends... 
or it was Matthew Burnaby, who owns a hot dog place on by Coronado. Okay. We got Little Nita's Burritos. Mm. And the best part was the bottom, because that's where all the, the green chili settled and everything. Oh yeah, and then the tortilla gets like that lovely sog. Yeah. That is just like, it's like now flavored tortilla. So I'm glad you mentioned that, because that's yeah. actually the case and we found it. Now this is Liz, um, the Crazy Lizard off of Jefferson by Stone Forge, mm -hmm. or across, what's that other bar there? Gecko? No, 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 no that has like no. 20 taps. Oh, Fox and the Hound. Oh, okay. It's, it's by that place. Okay. Um, so the burrito, this... the burrito smells good. It looks like it's been grilled mm -hmm. or I don't yeah. know what you call that. That are, um, Panera. Yeah. No. <laughs> Panera. It's, it's been Panera. They took it to Panera. Mm -hmm. They panera it, brought it back. No, I don't know what you call it. Foreman that. grilled it. Foreman grilled. Panini thingies. It's panini. Like the, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's been panini pressed, which I'm not, it looks pretty good. The sausage do, they do look different though. It's like in little squares. Yeah. And... Oh, I took a picture because I wanted to bring this up. They said the sauce, is, they said this is all organic. Oh. And it says the uh, the sausage is from South Valley Kaiser pork. Nice, non GMO chicken. We don't have chicken in here, but Estancio pinto beans, organic black beans and onions. Nice. And organic New Mexico green chili, of well, course. Well, you can see the difference. Like, I'm just gonna point that out. Like here is the organic sausage. <laughs> <laughs> And then here is probably the knot. Right. And yeah, more earthy. Mm, I can taste the GMOs in this one. You can. I'm just <laughs> <laughs> it tastes like red dye number nine. Right. <laughs> <laughs> tastes like crushed up bug. So I'm gonna start with the end. <laughs> wow, definitely different taste. Mm-hmm. Mmm, that was a big bite. <laughs> mm. What I noticed, definitely, um, right off the bat, this doesn't have like hash browns or anything like that. It's just eggs mm -hmm. and sausage and green chili. Mm -hmm. You see this has kind of green chilies, yeah. hash browns, uh, this pinto beans from um, the range, but I got stuck to the burrito, so I'll eat it anyway. <laughs> <laughs> right? That's a contaminated bean. <laughs> I do like this one because it has like a lot. You can taste the seasonings and the flavor. Mm. Mm -hmm. The flavor is so much different. Mm -hmm. How would you explain that flavor difference? Um, like you said, maybe more earthy. Well, and earthy and not in like that bad way, like <laughs> like dirt. <laughs> not no, it does not taste like dirt. <laughs> <laughs> it just has like that like whole food taste where you can taste the herbs that like everything was cooked with right instead of like probably over processing and putting like whatever you know it's it's um i know what you're saying free range i feel more free range and then connect with the earth when i eat this <laughs> than i do with this one right <laughs> the range burrito is really good though mm -hmm. it is. Mm -hmm. It's, uh, you know, I'm not a fan of GMOs and highly processed foods, but, mm -hmm. um, I don't know their whole situations with the range in there, but I just happened to know the crazy mm -hmm. lizard cause they had the sign and I took a picture and you know, in no way am I saying that they really good burrito on the range, yeah. but I, I, I'm with you here. This okay. has more something. It's like, it's like a burrito that you would get like at a family gathering mm. and there was probably a lot of like thought and effort put into making and it taste Carino really love. good. Yeah, and just like, it's like something where, yeah, family gathering and we made burritos. And it tastes really good. And, you and it's it, panera right? And, yeah, or George Foreman. <laughs> or, or panini press, I don't know. Mm. But the tortillas, you can see, has some sort of crispy layer. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's always key. And you can see how the it's kind of spread out in there versus my already half-eaten uh, range <laughs> burrito, which is still good. Yeah, and they're very generous with the eggs and with the sausage. Mm -hmm. There's there's a lot of um, yeah, but it does. It totally has different textures. 
Different texture, different taste. Mm -hmm. Jen's separating, separating out all the little sausages. Yes, I'm going to segregate them now. Well, what if they touch? Is it GMO spread? Is it like Zika where um, they can be transferred? This sausage might get sued <laughs> by this sausage because the GMO <laughs> molecule went onto this one. Oh, that's right. It, the air pollock. <laughs> and it cross-contaminated. So. Yeah. <laughs> Farmer John's pigs got cross-contaminated with... with um, Big business pigs. <laughs> I'm not gonna use names because we. <laughs> no, we are completely neutral. <laughs> yeah, this does taste like a Whole Foods, like. Yeah, like just Whole Food, Whole Food, not like the store. Right, right, right. <laughs> not. Uh, have you been to Chipotle? What are your thoughts about Chipotle? Mm. So many thoughts. I mean, they're good. I like it. Well, they supposedly have that kind of stuff, and then I've heard stuff where they say that they don't actually do what they say. So mm -hmm. I go back and forth, but because there is, there's like so much conflicting information, and and I don't know what's right, but or like that um, the meat was contaminated with this like super bug, and then people are saying it was planted by a corporation, and we won't say names. Burger King. No, <laughs> I'm just joking. No, <laughs> those commercials freak me out too. That King. With that smile, and it's all Hey, I'm like... just thinking the Burger King, man, he's, <laughs> he's tied into everything. He is, huh? That, that mustache makes him, like, uh, snidely whiplash, but I do like... That's <laughs> a serious mustache. <laughs> but I do it like really the Burger is. King. It's like, and it probably has fries and, like, food all <laughs> stuck in it. <laughs> like... Little chicken nuggets or the chicken fries or whatever yes. they sell. <laughs> Little lettuce pieces, like... Ah, uh, they start to sprout. <laughs> We just don't know what's in it. What's in his beard? <laughs> Burger King, if you're watching, let us know what's in your beard what in the comments. In, well, I know. What is in your beard, Burger <laughs> King? People want to know. <laughs> Inquiring minds. At least two people want to know. <laughs> yeah. Maybe others. I think the burritos make me happy. <laughs> yeah. I'm excited. Well, now that I have something in my body, I'm hungry. Mm -hmm. And I was driving around getting these see? different places. I was like shaking. I'm like, new food. <laughs> I didn't even know what I was coming. You just said burritos, and I'm like, I'm there. Yeah. I have to eat a burrito anyways. <laughs> Might as well talk about it. Right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm. So, I guess uh, we have to decide on which one's better. I think we already know that answer, uh, mm -hmm. the way we've been talking. Yes. What's the deal with the separation? What are our thoughts here? The separation? Oh, I was... Do you like, the, you like this is, sausage better, right? I do like this sausage better. Um, is there anything you like the range burrito better than the... I do. I absolutely love like the eggs and how they were cooked and they're really fluffy. Yeah, the eggs were really good. And they were, and like this is it's a generous burrito. Yeah, actually I would say, you know, right. I need I need to get a scale for these shows so we can say like And weigh it. Yeah, like okay, this well this, you know, this burrito weighs this, this burrito weighs this, this is the cost. This is how much you're going to poop out. <laughs> yeah, or <laughs> potentially. This burrito is 1.3 pounds. <laughs> and this one was 0.8. So if you go to the scale, there's a 1 pound buffer. Yeah, <laughs> right? <laughs> Um, this sausage will get stuck in your intestines and you might be able to poop out this one. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that's funny. So you, I did, I would agree with you there. I like the yeah. eggs. Here you don't, the eggs aren't the hero of the no. burrito. In, mm -hmm. in the range burrito, the eggs are the hero. Big hero. And like the potatoes and the green chili and like the extra, um, crisp of the tortilla mm -hmm. is that I really like that. Like I, I, mm -hmm. You almost can't taste the eggs in the, in the in the crazy lizard burrito. Well, let me I mean, open it. <laughs> I mean, it's not something that comes to your mind. I taste the sausage. Was I it, taste were there the eggs in it? Were there supposed to be eggs? Yeah, I mean, I got very sparing oh, eggs. Okay, they're like in the hiding in the corner. Maybe they were more towards the middle, yeah. and we're at the bottom now. And this one was just like... Eggs galore. Egg! <laughs> and then like, we'll sprinkle in some sausage. We'll and throw sprinkle, some, pepper it with sausage. And then throw some green chili on it, mm -hmm. and then put some cheese, I think, was on there. Yeah, there's cheese and... Different... Yeah, Actually, I think it's like depending on like what people like and you know like if you're I think either way if you're really hungry Yeah, both will take care of the job. Yeah <laughs> Both will get the shakes. It's a burrito to green chili <laughs> <laughs> Both will get the job done um, Definitely different burritos. Mm -hmm. So if you like eggs, uh, I guess we can break it down like this if you like eggs in your burrito and that's a big deal uh, go with the uh, range, range burrito. Mm -hmm. We interviewed one of his uh, a girl Lexi Palmer <coughs> And she said she doesn't like too much eggs. So hmm. she would go probably with this other burrito here, yeah. the Crazy Lizard. What are your mm -hmm. thoughts on eggs? I like um, 
I like everything perfectly even. Like mm. I want it to have equal amounts of salt. That's probably why I started, and it's probably like a neurotic thing of mm -hmm. like must control everything. <laughs> <laughs> and so yeah, but it's like I like the perfect amount of egg and just like the ratios of everything. So it's like interesting, not overwhelming. Like if there's too much sausage, then that's you know yeah, it's overbearing. Too much sausage is <laughs> and that's and that's. Kind of takes it back to the very beginning when you mm -hmm. said you like to dip the sauce because you want to control the sauce. Yeah, exactly. It's like a, it's like let me at least control my food <laughs> in my world. Yeah. It's not like the, the soup Nazi. Here's your soup, and then you have to like eat it under his like mm -hmm. communist, you know, <laughs> ways. <laughs> okay, that's interesting. So, who would you pick over the two? If you, I would pick the now, crazy let's lizard. Say, you're going crazy lizard. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm going crazy lizard too. I'm going crazy lizard, but then there's also like that thought process of like. I, I think you should have told me before, or like not told me about the organic oh, and, then it, and, and then, the GMO and, and then, all that stuff. And then sprinkled in on the end as like and a then, little... And just be like, okay, so which one do you like? And then I'm like, oh my God, I love this one. And you're like, oh, well that one is That's from... a full organic deal. Yeah, or not, you know what I mean? And it's <laughs> That's just full like, GMO. Can, can we really know, like, can you taste it? Like it is, I mean, you Yeah, you're right, I, I, I probably um, <laughs> gave the burritos an advantage and disadvantage because I sprinkled that in in the beginning. Mm -hmm. and should have uh, done that at the end. So next time we have an organic burrito, which there will be another one. We'll tell people in the end, right? And yeah, see. yeah, and just see. I had I had in the range put more GMOs in this one. <laughs> <laughs> Give me some more GMOs, and then I had Crazy Lizard, you know, go very organic. Total. With it. These are like <laughs> they're. I mean, I feel free range out of after eating this burrito. Like I'm a free range human, and now I feel like. I'm going to go up back onto your roof and start crying <laughs> off the roof again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I like the Crazy Lizard too. Yeah. Um, I like the Range Burrito, um, but between the two, I'd rather go Crazy Lizard. Mm -hmm. what I, what, and why that is, is <laughs> Jen's rebuilding her burrito to her <laughs> yes. liking. I'm inserting more egg from Free Range or from the... <laughs> She's having a Franken Burrito. <laughs> transfer some egg over. Yeah. Can we get an egg transplant, please? Please. I need an egg transplant. Did it take? Did the egg, eggs it take? It took. It took. Okay, so the egg's now part of it and it's all good? Yeah. Yeah. It's going to be delicious, too. <laughs> oh, man. I like these uh, both for different reasons. Why I would say Crazy Lizard over the other one is just I like the general profile of having all that stuff in it. Mm -hmm. I don't like just eggs and sausage, but I would buy that one because I did today. Yeah. yeah. And, yeah. I have, yeah. and I have before. I uh, bought the Range Burrito. It's really good. Mm -hmm. Now, to counteract that, we didn't give them a fair chance. You know, they have beans and uh, mm -hmm. these little hash brown things. They're pretty good. You know, these little things. The one bean I had was delicious. <laughs> the one Labored bean. to perfection. Mm -hmm. You can tell just by from the one bean. Yeah, it killed it from the there. The frijol. <laughs> that was my nickname in high school, by the way. Why? Was frijol because it's no, not even frijol. A, it's just frijol. Like frijol. Like because that's how that's how um sometimes in California they'll say that like oh frijol and like not frijoles but like hey it's a frijol you're a bean. Right. And so and it's not very politically correct but like <laughs> I'm half Mexican like my okay. mom my mom is from Mexico and so people would call me a beaner. Oh, okay. And so they'd be like, hey, frijol. And then These like, are the white kids? Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. And then even other, like, you know, Mexicans sure, or whatever. Sure, sure. And so, but then it's like, I'm like, frijol. <laughs> That's not very nice. <laughs> like, <laughs> there wasn't a reason for that back then, at least. Like. <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah. So that's your nickname. Now you embrace the nickname. Mm, it's not now, but it might be again. Because ah, people okay. now heard it again. So And it was also Chipmunk Cheeks. Ah, uh, okay. Mm -hmm. Everybody had their nicknames. Yeah. I don't remember what mine were, but... Yeah. Kids kids can be interesting. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what is Mason and everybody doing today? Mm. Refereeing. Oh, okay. So they're out in the field? Mm -hmm. Oh, well, I guess on a field... Uh, He's a basketball ref. Yep. So it'd be a court, right? Mm -hmm. Not a field. <laughs> court. Yeah. 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 Basketball ref. And he took Mason so Mason can go and play and be around other kids. That's so. cool. Mm-hmm. Mm. Tortilla in my teeth. <laughs> yeah. This, it's a busy, fun, awesome day. And it's gorgeous, too. Yeah, it's so. a beautiful day today now mm -hmm. in Turkey. No clouds. Cool breeze. We have the door open. Chloe's running around doing cat things on the roof, I think. Yeah, she's like rolling around going... <laughs> Meow, meow, meow. Okay, guys, uh, <laughs> we're going to get into the actual uh, other segment of this, um, but we both agree, based off of knowledge and taste 
and construction, I guess. Mm -hmm. how, oh, how was the one that you franken together? It was delicious. Yeah. I just wanted a little bit more egg. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's how it goes, yeah. right? So we both picked <laughs> the crazy lizard. Good job, guys, on your burritos. Yeah, also, delicious. good good job to the range. The range is amazing. That was a really good burrito, yeah. too. I mean, it's hard mm -hmm. doing this because, you know, the both outside of, you know, comparing it are really good burritos. Mm -hmm. But when you put them up against different burritos, you like different things about different stuff. So they have, both are great burritos, both 100% yeah. New Mexican. And it's nice to take a stand and actually, like, choose and mm -hmm. say, I like this one better. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if you were... At a buffet, a burrito buffet, if this existed, I would go with the crazy lizard over mm -hmm. the range. Now, mm -hmm. if I'm going to get breakfast with my family and uh, I may go to the range because they want to go there and it's close by or whatever the case mm -hmm. is. So, yeah. and the French toast and the oh, yeah, fans that have the cows. And <laughs> yeah, I like how they have the little blue the cows. Decor. Yeah, yeah, the decor, it's like really interesting and the cows look really, really happy. Yeah, and they even do. though they sell sausage, like I, I would like to see a few pigs there. Oh yeah, they don't have I, pigs. Or, do they? I don't know. I didn't. I didn't well, know I can't for pigs. sure say this, but I know they do have cows. <laughs> yes, <laughs> that's for sure. All right, guys. So today the winner is Crazy Lizard, but uh, overall both of them were great. Delicious. And follow us in the next episode where we talk to Jen about building fan base and just being goofy in life. Yeah. That's basically what we're gonna talk about. That's oh, cool. Sweet. Cool. All right. We'll see you guys later. <laughs> see ya.